Hey guys, so I noticed I have a bad egg in the incubator. Uh, you can smell it right when you open the door. And I was going through my eggs, and it turns out it's coming from this egg box right here. Uh, it's one. It's one that's only laid like six days ago. So take a look at this. Let me uh, move my tripod here. So you can actually see it's slightly discolored and it looks like it has a little bacteria around it and right on the side it looks like it has a little bit of mold going on there and uh, actually this this egg looks pretty bad too I think I'm just gonna toss this little boob egg <laughs> it's definitely infertile um, so I've been kinda of struggling uh, what to do on these and last time I tried a foot powder that didn't work very well so today what I'm going to try is something a little bit different let me show you what I'm doing here so I put this in the incubator and warmed it up to incubator temperatures I'm going to try this I've never seen it done before so we'll see if it actually works so it's actually a solution of 60 mils of iodine uh, in one of these shoe boxes filled with water so it's basically dilute povidone iodine and what I'm going to do I already measured the temperature it's about 88 degrees and I'm going to set this up for uh, let's say about 10 minutes and I'm just going to soak this in there for 10 minutes and Hopefully, that'll disinfect the, the egg. <laughs> Hopefully. So I'll put this original egg box back in the incubator. Every time there's a moldy egg or a little bacteria, I just like to, to get it out of that egg box. And I have another egg box here um, that I made up just for this egg so so basically what I'm going to do is I'll pull it right out I won't even dry it off and I'll put it right in here uh, after the 10 minutes and uh, I've actually discovered something else Let me get it here. So, actually, I've had problems with the eggs rolling in the past, and what I've decided to do is actually just use Q-tips. And you can put the egg right in here, and then surround it with Q-tips, and then you don't really have to worry about them rolling. And I think I'm going to start doing that with all my egg boxes. So, it's a long haul for this egg. Um, you know they're in the incubator for 55 days and it's been six so it's still 49 days um, we'll see if it actually improves or if it hatches or what's going on so I'll give you an update next time thanks